Okay, here's something we don't usually see or uh, very common. It's October, end of October, and in this pool it looks like there's just a bunch of slime here. Or some kind of dirt follicles or dirt pieces building up along the pool. But as we get closer, take a look, we'll find out that this is actually a type of insect swarm and they didn't really want to be in the pool. Let's see if we can get closer and you can see the movement. Will that focus? So you can see them moving now within the little clusters. These are called springtails and they're trying to hop. The reason you see the movement, the flicking, it's because they're flicking against each other and whatever uh, force they can get against the water. But there's literally thousands of them here. And they came from the soil. They're an indication of moisture. And it's really no problem out here. Let's see if um, I can scoop some up for you. Maybe we can get a better look in the sun. So they're springtails because they have this little tail that makes them flop or jump, appear to jump. And when you see these, these can be found all year long. And when you see them in the winter, sometimes people see them on a sunny day in the winter and they'll be out on the top of the snow and they'll call them snow fleas. So they're, they're pretty tough little ins, well, they're not insects, but they're pretty tough little bugs. <laughs> And um, if you see them in the house, then you have a moisture problem. You'll normally find these if the house has a wet basement, a very humid basement. They'll be living off the sheetrock and behind the sheetrock. And it's not really a pesticide control that would take care of these. It's a cultural control where you have to change the environment of the pest.